My research originally started with my PhD in an area called computer architecture, which is about the organization of computing systems. Over time, this then um, evolved into applying these concepts of the computer organization and parallel computing to the problem of um, big data. And you want to build computing systems which are very efficient at uh, processing uh, those data. Big data can be an important game changer for companies. Um, so the UK government has recently published a number of reports where they have analysed the potential benefits of big data on the economy, um, which is the idea that you, um, you would collect large amounts of data which is coming from various sources. From all the information there is a possibility to analyse that and to make insightful predictions, for instance, for businesses to where they need to go or how they need to sell things and so on. The non-volatile memory is a, it's a new uh, technology and is being developed and it will be soon on the market. You will be able to use it as a main memory for a computer, so the, the memory where you operate on while you are uh, making computations. And you are also working with uh, several uh, industry partners, for instance Wind uh, Telecom in Italy. So we'll be applying our techniques on, on, their, um, on their data set and trying to identify um, new ways to, for them to um, create business models out of the data that they have already. Uh, besides working on the non-volatile time memory, I'm also investigating ways to program uh, systems for um, uh, big data processing. In this area we're looking at programming models where we believe they can be uh, more efficient. And on the other hand, uh, we want to define uh, the system in such a way that it can be executed and scheduled more efficiently. For the non-volatile memory, I'm collaborating with SAP in Belfast. I'm also involved in various European projects and uh, one of these is called ASAP and it stands for a Scalable Analytics Platform. And in this project in particular, we are looking at big data processing uh, platforms and how we can uh, make them more efficient and uh, more effective.